All right, hi guys. Uh, today we're gonna do a video a March on Ifrit, uh, Final, Final Fantasy fourteen raid. Uh, we're gonna do pro, we're gonna do elite. I'm uh, gonna see how I do it, and what most other people are doing it as well. Um, doing pro is more uh, time efficient. Uh, it's faster. But if you want to make the most out of your orbs and you can clear elite uh, and you don't feel like uh, refreshing orbs so much, do elite. Okay, because you get around 8k or 9k a clear. Uh, and on pro, you get about 3k plus plus, depending on the level of Ifrit. Uh, as I said before in my previous video, uh, the more everyone on the server kills Ifrit, his level goes up, and the bonuses you get, uh, bonus points you get, uh, goes up as well. Uh, I believe his his HP increases as well, so it's a factor. All right. Anyway, let's get to it. All right. So pro. Ah, I didn't switch on the sound. Damn. Okay, let me switch off auto first. Um, okay, so this is Pro. March on Ifrit Pro, you can see. Anyway, it is possible to one turn kill uh, Elite. I think full water from Discord showed me, uh, but I'm trash at chaining uh, with the current units I have at the moment, so I can't do it. I can't one turn kill Elite. Uh, and also because I do not have enough uh, Sparkies, um, Olives TM, so I can't one turn kill because the elemental chains from uh, Cupid Luna aren't there, so the damage isn't enough. So we're not going to do that. We're going to do Elite, the slow roll way. Okay, so we've done Pro. Uh, we're going to do Elite now. Let me find a suitable... Uh, Noctis to use. Uh, I'm looking for a unit with ribbon because I do not want to spend my time healing the paralyzed off Noctis. Or I could use uh, Mr. Chocobo right here. Hmm. Does Ota have... Okay, Ota doesn't. Uh... Yeah, I'm looking for a ailment resist unit to use. Evidently, I do not have a friend that has one. He has a ribbon on. Uh, should be all right. Even though uh, Yun does not require a ribbon, as you can see here, because uh, if it only does uh, paralyze to you, and uh, Yun has it innate, so you do not need a ribbon on him. I would actually prefer a Noctis, to be honest. <sighs> okay, 
Okay, whatever. We're gonna use the Yun. Okay, as you can see, he has a ribbon on, uh, which is not needed at all. Uh, I would really want an Arctis, man. Okay, forget it. We're gonna do it with Yun. Do I have a friend, Yun? Okay, poison. Poison, Yun. Looks okay. Are we gonna go with poisons, Yun? I would really prefer Noctis for a full break. I mean, a half break. But. Uh, I do not have that, so let's go. Okay, last check on the gear. Okay, so we got 95% resist, 100% on Marie. I can switch this off. We don't need this right now. And uh, whatever, give more HP. Alright, so Yun. And Ling. Okay, so 80%, 140%, 105, 195% resist to fire. Let's go. Okay, so this is going to be a slow roll. Uh, we're going to see how long it takes. I'm going to narrate. Holy fuck. <laughs> oh shit, my auto was on. I am so screwed. Let me switch that off. Okay, I'm probably gonna die this turn. I think. Yeah, that was bad. Okay, so we're gonna try and rescue this. Uh, do not do what I did. Okay, so... The key to this is Bushido Freedom. You want to target your own units and do this. And then you want to keep the buff up. Dual cast on Marie. Oops. What is with my misclicks today? Uh, Bar Firaga. And then we want to boost the SPR of our allies. Alright. Then you do Raging Bird, Raging Bird. And then. Alright, so uh, we'll just try and do this as a break. Yeah, that was a bad start, guys. Do not do what I did. Bad idea. Still can rescue this run. But just remember to keep your auto off. Don't be an idiot like me. You should lower the volume. Okay, so double Akura. Ja. So you check. There's no debuffs on your team. It's fine. And then Marie can just do whatever. She can just uh, do this. And then do something like this. Reflect. I don't know whether it really helps, but whatever, right? Boost mag and SPR. Uh, gonna use Ling for restore MP, invigorating dance. And then we're gonna do this, raging bird. Okay, the proper sequence would be to use the skills first and then use invigorating dance on Ling. 
uh, otherwise you will lose uh, the extra MP that he, uh, she gives you. Alright. Okay, so now I'm debuffed again. As you can see, lowers fire uh, resistance. So what you want to do is Bushido Freedom. Target your own team. Check the HP of your team. Nobody's going to die. Okay, do it. Now everybody is dispelled. So there are no boosts, no uh, debuffs. Then we're going to heal back with Refia. Okay, this is the important part. When you use Marie, you make sure her buff is always up on your team. Alright, so buff Yuraga. And then maybe a Shelga to boost SPR for your allies. And now Raging Bird, Raging Bird. And then we get the MP back. Invigorating Dance. Okay, so uh, Elite Ifrit does hit hard. You can see Ifrit right here. Uh, if you're not prepared, it's going to hurt you a lot. So what we can do now is full life and Kuraja. This will check the buffs. Always check it every turn. I can dual cast heal. And then we can just do whatever. Um, I'm going to cast Reflect. And then maybe Imperial. Okay, no. Let's not do that. Dual cast. Defense. And Imperial. Raging Bird. MP recovery. Okay, so check for debuffs. We do not have them yet. So we have a free turn. Uh, free turn meaning you do not have to dispel your team. Heal up. Mm, I have Cecile Limit Burst right now, but I don't really need to use it. Do I? Okay, so uh, this Jin is was dead, and I rest him, so he does not have the buff. So he is in danger. So what you want to do is cast the buff again. And then do this. Now, um, Raging Bird, Raging Bird. Okay, why am I using Yun? Yun has Beast, beast Killer, so with Ifrit it's a 100% boost, which is pretty nice. Do I need to heal? No, I don't need to heal. I can just, I can just do this. And then uh, get the MP back again. Invigorating Dance. Okay, so the debuff is on. Um, what you want to do is Bushido again. As you can see, my Marie is dead, which will make this a little tricky. So you have okay. Yeah, you know what? The Bushido first. This one is gonna die. Okay, it didn't die. So now we don't have any buffs now, right? What we're gonna do? Revive all allies. 
Then we're gonna do a cast heal. Okay, keep in mind now, there are no buffs on my team. So it's very dangerous. So I do not want the Yuns to die again. I'm gonna boost their fire resist. Okay, so Marie is dead again. Uh, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna res Marie, and then we're gonna Kuraja. Check the buffs. Okay, in my opinion, uh, I should do this more than anything. Make sure the HP is up. Uh, reduce attack and mag. And then Raging Bird. I should be able to survive this turn with Marie alive. Okay, so the sequence would be I need to res this Yun and then I heal. Okay, so we do not have the fire debuff on us. And I need to recast the uh, Fira, whatever thing. Ba Firaga. And I want to boost the SPR on my team. And then uh, we might as well use the Asper. So uh, after all of this, uh, I think my unit's HP is fine. So I'm going to uh, get more MP, Invigorating Dance. I mean, as you watch, I hope you get my thought process of why I'm doing this, using this skill at this specific time. Okay, so the debuff is on right now. As you can see, lowest fire resistance. Check the HP, everybody's fine. Okay, target. Dispel. Uh, dual cast Kuraja. Heal the whole team up. Recast the buff. This is very important. I'm going to repeat it again. And then get some SPR boost. Uh, Raging Bird, Raging Bird, and Invigorating Dance. Alright. Since everybody's at full HP, we don't need Link to do anything. Get more MP back. It's important. Okay, so no debuffs, it's fine. We can dual cast heal again. Check the debuffs, no debuff. Okay, my MP looks okay, so I will go on and reduce and break if it. And uh, limit burst. Okay, I, I want to reduce, what skill is this? Anti-element, reduce uh, elemental resistance of Ifrit. Okay, this could be done a lot faster, but I'm just explaining as we go. Raging Bird, Raging Bird. Okay, check the debuffs. None. Which is good. Dual cast heal. Okay, 
we're just gonna mess around and do this and maybe some defense raging bird okay uh I mean it doesn't really matter at this point it's gonna be ending and probably just heal for fun all right so this is elite done uh, it could be done much faster but I want to explain what I'm doing and why as I went along uh, in my opinion ribbons are pretty important or you can use uh, status ailment immune units Oh, 9,800 points for Elite. Uh, okay, because of the level right now. Um, because you can use Luneth, uh, Raphia, and whatever. Yun is status ailment resistant as well to paralyze. So the main key problem is paralyze in, in, the, in this uh, raid. You want to keep an eye on that shit. So it's 980 raid coins for Elite. I'm going to show you the gear one last time before I shut down the video. Um, the lapis isn't that important to me, so I don't really care about the missions. Okay, this was the pro party. Um, this is the gear. If you're wondering why I can auto pro. Second Yuan. Same gear, little worse materials. Third Yuan, uh, different materials again. Uh, same gear here. Olive. Um, I took a quick, quick assault and put it on Ling, so yeah, missing one. I could have it on, but it doesn't really matter that much. Alright, so this is the gear. This is the other one. Alright. So this was my pro party, and then this is my elite one. Okay, so I have a lot of resist gear on uh, all my units, uh, namely Rainbow Rope, uh, Melody of Life, uh, Successor. Successor is a pretty nifty uh, TM for this raid. You don't take that much damage. Um, Resist is 100% on Marie. Minerva, Minerva Bastia, 30%. Further Armlet is 20%. And one successor. So 100%. Uh, my win with 105% resist. Um, nothing really special. It's just because he has Ifrit on him. Uh, Cecile. Cecile is 140%. Uh, these you can get from without being a TM, you see. Flame Shield, uh, Flame Mail. I, I specifically went to the exploration and got these uh, items for this raid. Successor, Successor from Shara, everyone knows that. Bushido Freedom is from the Gilgamesh Trial. Uh, it's pretty important in my opinion if you want to clear Elite. Alright, so 140%. And then Ling is at 80%. Uh, Minerva Bastia again. Yep, and that's about it, guys. This is my party that I used. Mm, I, as you can see just now, I was looking for a status ailment resist uh, friend unit. And I think that's what you guys should be putting up. Or you can have Marie up there. She's pretty nice for this raid. If everybody's gonna do elite, of course, but it's okay. It's, uh, pro is just fine. It's just that it's not as efficient with the orbs, but uh, it's an exchange, I guess, because pro is faster and elite gives you more uh, rate coins and points. So if you have the time, just and you can clear elite, just do elite. Or if you're a whale and you're gonna spam lapis and refresh, just do pro. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, uh, and uh, 
I hope you have a lot of fun on this raid actually. I'm gonna be skipping this player's choice banner because I have no reason to pull at all. I've got multiples of all these things. Uh, I don't really need them. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, subscribe, like, share, share it with people. And uh, take care. See ya.